Hi everybody, hi every spirit, welcome once again to the channel, Esoteric Cloud Surfer here on Ezosu Gaming, ready for another episode of Pokemon Sword and Shield Online VGC Battles, where we climb the online ladder with teams that I build and sometimes when I'm working between teams with some rental teams that I find interesting. We are here using our most recent Rayquaza team. Thank you very much for watching. If you want to support the channel, drop a like and a subscription. It helps YouTube recommend the channel. If you want to support me directly, you can donate using P PayPal to my email esotericsurfer69 at gmail.com and I wish you the best thoughts, ideas, feelings and emotions a whole bunch of individuality and creativity. Remember, you can join the Discord by following the link in the description below. And let's get to it. Let's go! We found a trainer, a Korean trainer, Kali Rex Shadow, Thunderous, that can be Dynamax Thunderous, no, no, no problem. But other than Urshifu, I think Colossal got it, right? So, Rayquaza is good for the Urshifu, the Dragapult itself is good for the Urshifu. So maybe we deal with quiz? What do they lead with? With Urshifu... Oh, they can go for a Trick Room? That can, that can, uh, that can be useful to us. Magnazone here doesn't feel very good. It's good for the Urshifu as well, but it's still typing, right? Puts it in a bad position. Um, Rayquaza and Melos one. Colossal Dragapult. Because the normal one is great for every Pokemon he has, but the Urshifu. The thing is, Rayquaza can deal with Urshifu, right? <clears throat> so we can switch the normal one to Dragapult and finish the Urshifu with the Rayquaza. If they leave it. In Divi Calyrex. Oh, does it have Expanding Force? Is he going to Dynamax right away? Is that the case? Mm. <clears throat> what I wanna do here? Double up into Calyrex actually? We can Icy Wind Just to make sure Dragapult is faster on the next turn, right? We can also Rock Tomb. They follow me, that's fine. That's why we use Icy Wind. They go for Astral Barrage. Nothing too new there. Is this a double knockout? No! It's not even a knockout. Awesome! Dragon Ascent. Beautiful animation. Whoa! Rayquaza is strong, y'all. I, I just think the typing Dragon Flying is not the best for this format. Okay. Are we faster? 
I don't think so. <gasps> Memo! No! Uh, do we bring Colossal right away? Or... Mm, our speed here is... Ah, it's me I think we're faster. Especially with the... Um, with the Icy Wind. Right? So let's go Dragon Ascend. Or Dragon Descend? Dragon Ascend? And Dragon Darts. Oh, you feel Dynamax? It's actually a great defensive Dynamax. I forgot how to remember Swine had Black Orb. Okay, Dragon Dart. One is enough to knock out in mid, I believe. Nice. The other one goes into Calyrex. And I hope Rayquaza is faster. Oh, what? First, we're not faster. Third, where is the other Dragon Dart? Damn it. I thought we... So in that play, we should Dragon Dance. As we Ice Wind, we should Dragon Dance as well. Because this, this, this is one of the, the factors of using like Rayquaza, a Pokemon that I never used before. I need to know like when I drop speeds, what's our position? Are we still good here or, you know, things like that. Okay. We should go for a vocal lead into Calyrex. Because even with one speed drop, our request was slower. Now I know that. But I didn't do before. Okay, the, the Dynamax Calyrex. It's not bad for us, it's not bad. enough though yes okay okay this first match this first match is we still learning how to use request because request is strong we just so we just don't know how strong and in which uh, for not formats not setups in which um, matchups is it strong in right Let's go! Zashin team with Landorus, Grimmsnarl, Venusaur, Tyranitar and Torko. Why the Titar though? Right? Why the Titar? Hemoswine looks... Hemoswine can hit everybody but the Grimmsnarl for super effective damage. So Hemoswine... Maybe we need like... Here Colossal is looking great. Rayquaza not so much, especially against the Zashan. 
because most because if, if they lead Zashen, we can't do much here, right? But if they lead Tyranitar, we can also just Dynamax Colossal out of nowhere. We can Will Wiz as well. Okay, I, I really like Nemo and Red Coaser uh, double dual. Now the Magna Zone we didn't drop once. Right? Because the most common water type, I think it's Urshifu, which is also a fighting type as well. And flank type, we don't see much. We see Landorus, which is a ground type, which is not good for Magnazone as well. That's why we don't see a lot of Magnazone. It's not the type. Okay. Well, I want to Dynamax very much. But they can just bring uh, the turtle in and throw a sleep powder on us. That would be disaster disastrous for us. And I want to willow wisp that Lunderous, actually. <coughs> ah damn, I really don't want to. Damn, I really don't want to eat the sleep powder. What we can we don't have taunt. We can change the weather. We go for a Surf, we can Dynamax the Landorus. I think I will always the Landorus, and I switch into Mamoswine. I really don't want to catch a Sleep Powder, you know. Oh, they withdrew into the Torkoal, right? Yeah, okay. Okay, so it's, it's either a Blind Sleep Powder or Max um, Venusaur into Vine Lash. It was Sleep Powder! And they miss! Awesome! I really, I really didn't want to get Sleep Powder on that end. Okay, we switch Rayquaza in. We go for Ice Shot, yes, because Venusaur is going to be super fast. I think he's going to try and knock out the Bama Swine in front of it. We could switch! Oh, that would be a great play. And then Surf. Because in the sun we do less damage. The effects of weather disappear. So that, that does that mean that Venusaur loses... Whoa, almost one hit knockout. That Venusaur loses a speed boost? Weather Ball. Okay, that's gone. Byron Swine. Great. What? The effects of weather disappear. No way! The effects of weather disappear! So... The... Weather Ball is just... A Weather Ball! A normal type Weather Ball! Awesome! Awesome, awesome! I started again. They can switch into... Zashan... Or the... Or the Landorus! So we can Ice Wing, actually. We can... We can Icy Wind, because they're not faster now, right? Oh no, they are, because there is no airlock. Is, is that it? I'm, I'm confused. They withdrew! Into the Zashan. Okay, they're gonna eat an Icy Wind. He goes for a heat wave? Burning Jealousy! Oh! We super speedy now! Don't you forget about that! And they have Lunderers in the back. Oh, I think we go for Max Fire into Zashan. We have no fear. And so we have Lunderers in the back. And the Venusaur. That's scary, so I want to burn it. So let's go Rayquaza here. And I oh, they, they can burn him, Jell. Uh, I wanted to, uh, to Dragon Death with the um, Rayquaza, but I don't want to. 
I don't want to get burning jealousy. We can go for rock tomb. But I think that's not much damage. Right? Uh, mm, if they burn us, we don't have much, much chance there. Let's go for a rock tomb. Okay, they weave through, that's fine. Just want some damage into the landers. That intimidate, okay, okay. Because you don't have a weakness policy, you're not doing too much damage. I mean, we have the weakness policy, but it's not activated. Oh, turtle protects! Okay. It's good for us. For earthquake, all oh, the ah, oh, but we're gonna get to sleep because that would activate our weakness policy, right? But we sleep, we sleep. Oh, the there is almost out. Okay. Oh, and they have a berry. Fine, fine. Super fine. We asleep, unfortunately. We still asleep. So, are they going to Dynamax Torko? I want to Dragon Dance once, one more time. Are we, are we being too greedy with the Rayquaza? We can just burn in Jealousy. They go for Body Press! <clears throat> it's not enough. to get the exhaustion right away right away all right if we can get a meteor beam into the torque that would just be amazing oh no no meteor beam and we rock to possession okay they go for protect that's fine Wake up! Are oh, we still asleep? Damn it! If we get that... <clears throat> they go for yawn into us! That's fine. Okay, they still receive damage there. And there. Alright. 
Meteor Beam, please wake up. Please wake up. We need that Meteor Beam damage. Come on. They withdrew. Okay. We, we woke up. Let's go meet your beam in your face. Oh no, we need to wait. I forgot about that. I forgot we need to wait one turn. No. I really forgot. I really, really forgot. Hey, but the stories keep going. And, ah, oh, but we fell asleep now. I think Dragon Bolt is not faster. But unless they have play rough, which most don't, we should be alright. Because we just will always. We just will always. But. I don't know. Will always and walk to the. the Torkoal. We'll be asleep, we can do it. We can too much there. The Dynamax Torkoal, I told you! I told you! Are they going for Max Fighting? Max. Fire? The quiz is fast asleep, that's fine. Or we faster and we hit the little wisp. And they go for a behem behemoth blade. It shouldn't do much. Hit the bird. Whoa, we still have. Alright. Max Knuckle to boost the attack. Okay, okay. I like that play actually. I actually like that play. Because even though the burn is on, Zashin will do even more and more damage. More and more. You know? So let's go Phantom Force and Rock 2 once again. Rayquaza is still fast asleep, we can do nothing about that. We go for Behemoth play. Oh, that was enough for a knockout. Okay, is that enough to knock out the Zashin? Because of the burn and things like that. I mean, all the life he's lost was with burns. Who is it? Yeah. I think we didn't attack the Zashin. And Turtle can't can do much against us. So if we get the knockout here, which we don't, is that bulky Zashin? What? We lose, no way. No way. Because of the yawns. It was a great match though. But we lost in the end. I mean, but they have all meta teams. We are here causing damage with Rayquaza. We need something in the Rayquaza to hit the Zashians with. We don't have. We have nothing to hit the Zashin with. Now let me see that Zashin. It was not bulky. Actually, he had no attack investment. Even though ah, I had a lot of HP though. It had a lot of HP. Coco! 
Kakoro. Kyogre. With Blaziken and Salamence. Rhizmipod, Urshifu, and Silver Stealer. Hmm. I think they're gonna leave Kyogre. How do we counter the Kyogre to leave? The Magnazone. Magnazone Rayquaza? Colossal Dragapult, I believe? I don't know. Let's look. Magnazone, show me what you can do. I think we can put the Regilek in your place. I think it's better. I just didn't want to use anything that was too meta. But... I we need some wins. I want some wins. Let's go. Let's see. I think it's a Kyogre. It is. Kyogre with me caught. Damn it, when it taunt. Magnazone is good in this scenario. We can ally switch. Uh, I think here they just Dynamax the Kyogre. Right? So we double up or do you, no because they're gonna tell win so we are actually do we have an X Colossal? Because Colossal is gonna be gone against the Kyogre. Let's see, let's see, let's double up into it. You can, if you dynamax you can only knock off one of us. Oh I think it's water spout play. Yeah, I, I forgot about water spout. Damn it, that's why if you want to be a good oh, BGC player, you need some form of routine and pattern. You don't need to play every single day, you don't, not every single day, but you need routine and pattern. That's su super short. But, okay, the Dynamax, so there is no water spot play. They can only knock up one of us. I think it's going for the, the, the Magna Zone, infinitely. Right. Then we max guard with a Colossal. Then we gone. We're faster though! Rayquaza are faster than a Kyogre! Max Ailstorm! So they thought we were Dynamaxing Rayquaza! We're not! Oh, and that's good because they take the rain! Ah, we, could, we can do the um, 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 Colossal Protect play! What? That's no damage! Oh, thank you! What trick room? Thank you! Come on, Magnazon! I know you can do better! The Requisite did more damage! And it was not super effective! What, what you talking about? Magnazone. Let me see your special attack. It's almost 200. Maybe that Kyogre is super bulky. Oh, we can ally switch. Let's do it.
you know for helping hand okay you know for all my switch oh come on that's no damage you need a witness policy activated Bye, Magna. Magna Zone is no good. We need to switch it for the Reggie Becky. It's unfortunate, but that's why, that's why the Pokemon are meta, because they're good, right? And you, you, you can only run from meta as a, a little bit before you just run away from the wings as well, right? So. It is what it is. We can attack first here with the max flare in order to not be knocked out here. Or we we'll go for the max guard into the into dragon darts. Maybe we we'll knock out the, the, the Kyogre with dragon darts. The damage that uh, Rayquaza, Magnazone and Colossal did end up helping the the the, the Dragon Ball. I don't know. The Max Guard. They go for Max Gaza, but what? No! We could have knocked out, knocked it out. Damn it. Damn it, damn it. It was a super bulky. I mean, we also don't have bitch. I knew that. We also don't have uh, the witness policy activated on colossal side, right? But I just didn't expect the mechanism to do that little damage. You know, it was too little damage. Oh, really? Weird. Yeah. Oh, we have no hand, water spout, we won. Origin goes, that's it. Okay. Okay. Okay, guys, it's everything for today. Magnazone is out, Red Lake is in. I think Mian Shao will, uh, take, will take its leave as well. And the fairy will come in. So in certain games, when a focus on Dragapult Colossal uh, core, Cool Fairies have to help. You know. So thank you for watching anyway. I want to check in. I want to see that Kyogre. Salamence. One hundred and sixty of special. A lot of HP as well. Super bulky. Okay, guys. Thank you very much for watching, and until next time, love yourself, because I love you. See you soon, and join the Discord by following the link in the description below. See you soon, have a nice day, enjoy yourself, and be passionate about yourself. Bye!